8 Strange Skin Signs Indicating Your Liver Is Damaged Liver plays a huge role in keeping your body running smoothly, from breaking down toxins to digesting your food. When the liver starts struggling, your skin might just be the first place to show it. It's easy to overlook subtle skin changes or write them off as nothing serious, but these signs shouldn't be ignored. In this video, we'll dive into the different skin symptoms that can pop up when your liver is damaged. Understanding these signs is crucial because early detection can lead to better management of liver conditions. Before we dive in, please note, all the information in this video is created by real people, thoroughly fact-checked, unbiased, and reviewed by qualified professionals. 1. Yellowing of the skin and eyes, or jaundice. One of the most well-known signs of liver damage is jaundice, which refers to the yellowing of the skin and the whites of the eyes. This yellow color develops because of the buildup of bilirubin, a yellowish substance that is usually processed by the liver. When the liver is damaged or not working properly, it cannot filter bilirubin out of the blood effectively. This substance then accumulates, leading to the characteristic yellowing. Jaundice in newborns usually begins in the face and can spread down to the chest, abdomen, and even the limbs if left unchecked. It's often accompanied by dark urine and pale stools. While jaundice is strongly associated with liver issues, it can also be caused by other conditions such as blood disorders, like hemolysis, where red blood cells break down too quickly, or blockages in the bile ducts. If you notice a sudden yellowing of your skin or eyes, it's important to contact a doctor immediately. Jaundice is a red flag for liver dysfunction and can indicate serious conditions like hepatitis, cirrhosis, or bile duct obstruction. This isn't a symptom to ignore or wait out. Seeking medical advice quickly can help identify and treat the underlying cause before more severe complications develop. 2. Spider-like red spots, or spider angiomas. Another visible skin sign that can point to liver damage is the appearance of spider angiomas. These are small, bright red spots that have thin, web-like extensions radiating outward, resembling a spider's legs. They are most commonly found on the face, neck, upper chest, and arms. While they aren't usually painful or bothersome, their sudden appearance can be alarming. Spider angiomas can occur in people without liver damage, especially pregnant women or those taking birth control pills, because they're associated with hormonal changes. However, they are more frequently seen in people with liver disease, particularly cirrhosis. Liver damage affects the body's ability to regulate estrogen, which in turn leads to the formation of these vascular changes on the skin. If you notice just one or two spider angiomas, it's not necessarily cause for alarm, as they can occur in healthy individuals. But if you start seeing multiple spots, especially alongside other symptoms like jaundice or fatigue, it's a good idea to see your doctor for further evaluation, as this symptom can point to severe liver damage. A healthcare professional can determine whether these spots are linked to a hormonal imbalance or if they point to more serious liver issues. Are you enjoying our video so far? If so, please give us some hints by dropping a like and we'll make more content like this. 3. Red Palms or Palmar Erythema Palmar Erythema refers to the reddening of the palms, particularly around the base of the thumb and little finger. The palms may feel warm to the touch, but aren't usually painful or itchy. This condition is often associated with liver disease, though it can also occur during pregnancy, as a side effect of rheumatoid arthritis or due to thyroid issues. The redness in palmar erythema is caused by changes in blood flow, which occur when the liver is damaged. In a healthy body, the liver helps manage the balance of hormones and other compounds in the blood. When it's not functioning correctly, these substances can accumulate or fluctuate, leading to the visible redness in the palms. Palmar erythema alone isn't a definitive sign of liver disease, but when it appears along with other symptoms like spider angiomas, fatigue, or unexplained weight loss, it may be indicative of liver dysfunction, such as cirrhosis. In such cases, it's worth bringing this symptom to your doctor's attention. Early detection of liver problems can prevent more serious health complications later on. 4. Itchy skin or pruritus. Itchy skin or pruritus is a common but frustrating symptom that can be associated with liver damage. 
People with liver disease often experience itching without any visible rash. Itching can affect specific areas such as the scalp, arms, legs, and torso, but may also spread across the entire body and can become worse at night. Scratching can lead to skin damage, including redness, raw patches, and even infections if the skin is broken. While itchy skin can be caused by many factors, including dry skin, allergies, kidney disease, and stress, it becomes more concerning when it's persistent and widespread, particularly in the absence of any visible skin conditions. In liver disease, itching occurs because bile salts, which are usually processed by the liver, build up in the bloodstream when the liver isn't working correctly. These salts then accumulate in the skin, leading to the itchy sensation. If you experience long-term itching that isn't relieved by moisturizing or treating dry skin, and especially if it's accompanied by other signs of liver damage like jaundice or fatigue, it's essential to consult a doctor. Itchy skin related to liver disease won't improve with over-the-counter anti-itch treatments, and a healthcare professional can help manage the underlying cause. 5. Bruising easily. Easy bruising is another sign that may indicate liver damage. When your body bruises more frequently or more severely than normal, it might be a sign that something is going wrong with your blood clotting ability. You might notice bruises appearing after only slight bumps or pressure, and they can show up anywhere on the body, though the arms, legs, and torso are the most common areas. The liver is responsible for producing proteins that help your blood clot. When the liver is damaged or not functioning well, these clotting factors are reduced, meaning your blood can't clot as easily. As a result, even minor injuries can cause noticeable bruises. While easy bruising can also be caused by other factors, such as blood thinning medications, a lack of vitamin K, or certain blood disorders, persistent or worsening bruising should prompt a medical evaluation, especially if other liver-related symptoms are present. It's important to determine whether liver damage is contributing to your symptoms, as untreated liver disease can lead to more serious bleeding complications. 6. Yellow Bumps or Xanthomus Xanthomus are small, yellowish bumps that can appear on various parts of the body, including the eyelids, joints, or hands. These bumps are typically painless and slightly raised, and they can vary in size. They're caused by an accumulation of cholesterol under the skin and are often associated with high cholesterol levels. While xanthomus can occur in people with high cholesterol or diabetes, they are also a possible sign of liver damage. When the liver isn't functioning properly, it can interfere with the body's ability to process fats, leading to higher levels of cholesterol in the blood. This excess cholesterol can then deposit in the skin, forming xanthomus. While these bumps aren't harmful by themselves, they indicate an underlying liver issue that needs attention. If you notice these yellow bumps, especially if they're new or spreading, it's important to have your cholesterol levels and liver function checked by a doctor. Managing your cholesterol levels through diet, exercise, and possibly medication can help reduce the appearance of xanthomus and address the root cause. For those interested in the evidence, the studies supporting our claims are provided in the link in our description box. 7. Dry skin and hair loss. One of the lesser known signs of liver damage is dry, flaky skin and hair loss. The skin may feel tight, rough, or appear scaly, often becoming irritated and itchy. You may notice that no matter how much moisturizer you use, your skin stays dry. Similarly, hair may start thinning or falling out more than usual, appearing dull and brittle. Dry skin and hair loss related to liver damage stem from the liver's critical role in balancing nutrients, hormones, and hydration in the body. When the liver isn't functioning properly, it affects the body's ability to metabolize fats and essential vitamins, particularly fat-soluble vitamins like vitamin A, D, and E, which are key for maintaining healthy skin and hair. The liver also processes proteins, and when it's damaged, your body might not get the necessary nutrients to produce healthy skin cells and hair follicles. Dehydration and poor circulation, often side effects of liver dysfunction, further contribute to dryness and hair thinning. While dry skin and hair loss can indicate liver problems, they're also common symptoms of other conditions, such as hypothyroidism, stress, malnutrition, or simply aging. Environmental factors like cold weather, low humidity, 
or harsh hair products can also contribute to dry skin and hair loss. 8. Thinning of the skin. Thinning of the skin is another potential sign of liver damage. You might notice that your skin becomes paper thin, especially on areas like the forearms or hands, where veins and blood vessels may appear more prominent due to the thinning. Thinning skin is often linked to cirrhosis, a condition where the liver becomes severely scarred and cannot perform its normal functions. In advanced liver disease, the body's ability to produce proteins is compromised. Without proper protein production, the skin loses its thickness, becoming more fragile and delicate. Liver damage can also lead to hormonal imbalances. When estrogen levels rise in the blood, due to the liver not being able to break it down properly, it can lead to skin thinning. Additionally, people with liver damage often have poor circulation, which limits the nutrients and oxygen delivered to the skin, causing it to become thinner and more prone to injury. Please note that skin thinning is not unique to liver disease. It can also be caused by aging, long-term use of corticosteroid medications, or certain genetic conditions. However, when combined with other signs of liver dysfunction, it could indicate that liver damage is the underlying cause. When should you see a doctor? While many of these skin changes can have multiple causes, seeing several signs at once, such as jaundice, persistent itching, and easy bruising, should prompt a visit to your doctor. Even if you only notice one symptom, like jaundice, it's important to get checked out. Liver damage can be serious, and early detection is key to preventing further complications. If you notice new skin changes and are unsure of their cause, it's always better to seek medical advice rather than waiting to see if they improve on their own. In other words, one significant symptom like jaundice or multiple smaller signs combined, such as spider angiomas, red palms, and fatigue, should prompt you to contact a healthcare provider. These symptoms could indicate liver disease or other underlying health problems that need attention. Managing symptoms at home. While it's essential to consult a doctor for proper diagnosis and treatment of liver issues, there are some steps you can take at home to help manage skin symptoms. Hydration is key for maintaining healthy skin, supporting liver function, and preventing liver disease. Drinking plenty of water helps flush out toxins and keep your skin from becoming too dry, which can worsen itching. Aim for at least eight glasses of water a day, and more if you're physically active. For itchy or dry skin, applying a high-quality, fragrance-free moisturizer can provide some relief. Avoid harsh soaps and hot showers, as they can strip the skin of its natural oils and make itching worse. Instead, opt for lukewarm water and gentle moisturizing cleansers. Another crucial step is to avoid alcohol. Alcohol is hard on the liver, and if you already have signs of liver damage, drinking can accelerate the progression of liver disease. Cutting out alcohol entirely is one of the best ways to support your liver and prevent further damage. You can also support your liver by eating a liver-friendly diet. This means focusing on whole, unprocessed foods like fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, yet try to limit animal protein intake, and whole grains. Avoiding fatty, fried, and processed foods can reduce the strain on your liver. Additionally, maintaining a healthy weight is important as being overweight can contribute to liver problems like fatty liver disease. Managing stress is another important factor. High levels of stress can exacerbate many skin conditions, so finding ways to relax can help improve your symptoms. Techniques such as deep breathing, meditation, yoga, or even taking time to enjoy a hobby can reduce stress and support your overall health. Lastly, it's important to protect your skin from further irritation. Avoid sunburns by using sunscreen and try not to scratch itchy areas as this can cause skin damage. Keeping your nails short and wearing soft, breathable fabrics can help minimize skin irritation. Conclusion Skin symptoms can be an early warning sign of liver damage, even if they seem unrelated at first. Recognizing these signs, whether it's yellowing of the skin, spider angiomas, red palms, persistent itching, easy bruising or yellow bumps, is crucial for getting the right care. If you notice several symptoms appearing at once or a significant change like jaundice, it's time to reach out to a doctor. We've got another video coming up that'll cover all the warning signs to watch out for, so turn on notifications so you won't miss it.
Liver issues can be serious, but with early detection and proper care, many problems can be managed or even reversed. In the meantime, you can take steps to support your skin and liver health at home by staying hydrated, avoiding alcohol, eating a healthy diet, managing stress, and protecting your skin. These habits will not only help improve your symptoms, but also contribute to your overall well-being. But remember, when it comes to liver health, it's always better to be safe and proactive, so don't hesitate to seek medical advice if you're concerned. Now, we want to send a big thank you to all our current subscribers and viewers. Your support inspires us to continue sharing valuable content. Hit the bell icon and turn on all notifications so you never miss a life-saving video. Just like with liver disease, the sooner you spot kidney issues, the more you can do to keep things under control. If you're unsure about your kidney health and haven't been in a good shape recently, check out the video on the screen. Here, we cover all the possible symptoms, helping you spot kidney failure and take action effectively if needed. See you there. Stay informed, stay healthy.